have to analyze the technology required to decide whether we can afford to develop the technology and how fast the technology can be developed. One of the worst mistakes we've made in the past and everybody makes from time to time is to overestimate our mastery of a particular technology. So a lot of effort now goes into technology. If we just said, give us the best ideas you can, they would come up with very, very big, expensive ideas because scientists are certainly not limited in imagination. And so what we have to do in some way is, is restrain their imaginations by adding a little bit of reality and some boundary conditions. So we brought up the idea of, well, if you get a smaller mission, an M mission, a medium mission, you're likely to see it fly <laughs> earlier than the large mission. Inevitably, the scientific goals are almost unquestionably fundamental. You could never uh, have the nerve to propose something that might cost uh, uh, 600, 700 million euros just from our contribution. And then you think of involving other countries, maybe you're talking certainly over a billion euros for the mission as a whole, maybe a billion and a half euros, you have to be tackling some fundamental question. You have to be telling, you've got to be able to stand up and honestly say, this will change the way we see our universe.